We're here on the Cooley Bridge on M55 over the Pine River, 20 miles west of Cadillac. It was finished in 1935. Pretty good condition for as old as it is. 83 years old. We, we have some uh, section loss here at this connection and a lot of pack rust due to weather conditions, which has caused uh, the pack rust to uh, bow this uh, connection plate out. So we are coming in to shore it up, secure it a little bit, beef it up a little bit. It's a temporary fix when they, uh, I believe this fall, later this year, they're gonna be doing a permanent fix on it. And what we did was we came in and uh, removed all the existing uh, rivets that you see around and replaced them with uh, high tensile strength uh, structural bolts. And now we're gonna bring down uh, some plates to put over here, which will go around these existing nuts here. Then we'll bring down another plate on top of that to go over the top of that and cap it off. Just uh, shore this up. There's a slight uh, bow in the plate back here. And uh, we have found uh, up to three eighths of an inch of uh, pack rust pushing the uh, plate out on the back side back there. We used the existing holes that the rivets were in. Then uh, we're gonna be drilling a couple additional holes just to strengthen up, tie into some of these uh, beams coming down, the vertical beam and this angled beam, tie into this a little bit better to make it a little bit stronger, strengthen it up a little bit. Yeah, we also have a certain procedure we have to use for uh, tightening these down. First, you gotta snug tight them. Then we'll have to uh, put an impact on and get a third of a turn to get the proper torque. So, every one of them. So that's what, what we call snug tight right there. The first plate we're bringing down though is just the three quarter inch plate. This one's approximately four foot long by 30 inches in height. It's gonna be the outer plate. The first one that's, is gonna be an inch and a quarter thick. It's gonna go over these nuts. Then the, the plate they're bringing down now is the cover plate. If all them holes line up the way we expect they will, we'll just put that plate on top of the inch and a quarter plate, transfer the holes over, and we'll start drilling the holes. Then we'll be able to transfer everything over onto the big plate and start drilling and hopefully get everything set tonight. Hopefully. Yeah. <laughs>